Okay, something very strange is going on today, but it's not something I could tell you about. I gotta show you first. Okay, we just replaced that entire tankless coil that was completely rusted out, bolts down to the nubs without a single problem. We didn't have to drill, tap anything. Bolts came out fine. Everything disconnected, went back together. No problems. Look, I didn't even get dirty. Something strange is going on today. Maybe there's a glitch in the matrix, but still too early to tell. Let's go to lunch. what one of my absolute favorite parking spots is and I got it not only did I get the spot at the end of the street it's also in front of a driveway talk about a two for one who in the relay I'm thinking we got a thermostat problem actually it would probably help if they turn the thermostat on just seems like it's air Would you like to know why I think there's air in the lawn? Go figure, let's see. No air vent, no air vent. Uh, tell me if you see an air vent anywhere on here. All right, so we're up to temp. I don't know why the thermostat stopped cooling. I mean, if I jiggle the wire, I don't think it's gonna do anything. Oh my God, now I'm starting to lose my mind. I knew this was gonna happen. Now I think it's a thermostat problem again. I go upstairs. I'm gonna put the batteries in to make sure it works. It works. If you're wondering why I was running up and down the steps and not using the elevator, well, <laughs> there is no elevator. Okay, so it did end up being the thermostat after all. It was just impossible to turn that thing, and when you did, it would kick on, but then decide to shut off randomly. So I just swapped it out, got a new one on. It's up and running right now. I still hear a little bit of air, so I'm gonna purge that out too. This was a really important lesson I learned today. When you ask someone to do something for you, even if you think you're being very clear, they might not get it. Don't always assume that the person that's listening to you understands the terminology and the lingo that we know. I asked her to turn the thermostat up. She turned it up by a degree. And then a couple minutes later, she went and turned it down. So here I am going crazy trying to figure out why it's not registering and kicking on the relay when it was just because the tenant didn't know which is totally fine. What I should have done different today was I should have went up and turned the thermostat up and said, I will come back and turn it down. This way I know it is to my satisfaction. And that goes for anything. If a breaker has to be shut off, you shut it off. If a valve has to be closed, you close the valve. You don't wanna let these things go to chance because there is a chance someone might shut off the wrong breaker, close the wrong valve, and you could run into a lot more problems that way. So best piece of advice, do it yourself. And I'll tell you what, that's the worst problem I had to deal with today. I give today an eight out of 10. So I stopped really fast because I want to take a cool time lapse of the city from across the river. And I thought people would find it weird, me just kind of walking around talking to my phone like this. No, you know what they stare at the most? <laughs> 